So we're here at FC United Broaders Park. Let me tell you about the King Len Johnson. He was harder than you, me, him, her, them, Bronson. And on Saturday the 27th of May, we're going to be taking on a team of FC United legends versus a celebrity team made up of the likes of Ricky Hatton, Crawler, Andy Burnham, local rappers Taze, Lady Ice, actors from Hollyoaks, Coronation Street, Waterloo Road, MMA and much more. All the money raised uh, will go towards building a statue to Manchester's Uncrowned Boxing Champion Len Johnson. It's an unbelievable story. We're unbelievably proud and happy to be bringing this event to the stadium. Um, this has been in my head for a couple of years now, so to see it come to fruition is very exciting. And yeah, pretty starstruck before meeting Carlos and Mike Norton, FC United legends, everyone knows who they are. Um, yeah, it's an amazing day. Get down Saturday, it's pretty something for me. He fought for his people's rights and jobs like his father fought in them booths. Len Johnson was a British boxer who, due to his um, basically being black, he was discriminated and not given the opportunity to fight for a British title. We're able to do so much with sport here to break down the barriers. And I want to be an example of it's not about how you look, it's about what you do in it. So action over intentions, I'm really excited about being there. It's going to be a big crowd um, and a massive cause. We left at 8 o'clock this morning. The time is, look, 13.52, right? There's been car crashes on the M6, M1, whatever motorways are here. So I was, I actually thought I was going to miss kickoff, which I am. And I said to him, look, if I have to come and play second half, I'll just play second half. So I could have driven six, five to six hours to play 45 minutes. Have you been Manchester before? A few times. Uh, business or um, other reasons. And we are the biggest and the best to ever do it. We will go down in the history of English football. You will never be able to buy that. We're the ancestors. We're going to be the ones, the pioneers that are remembered for the years to come. No one will tell you any different. No one. You ain't wrong. You're right, bro. You done? Sure, then you can see, let's kick off. She's getting changed. Any words? No. All right. Change in 30 seconds, what takes so long usually on a normal match day? I don't give a shit. This is the Len Johnson Cup being played at FC Manchester Stadium. At some point in your life, you have to stand up for what you believe in. And I believe that racism should not be tolerated. Next week, we return to non-league. But today, 0-1-6-1. Bugsy Malone. Who would have thought it Big G called a celeb? It's an absolute joke. However, one of my greatest achievements of when I started my football career was meeting Peter Shemak at Soccer AM. That's the kind of save that I used to watch him on YouTube and try and replicate. And the FC Manchester legends are on the attack. They put the ball into the area and the host of the actual the whole charity today is Lamin Torre. Have it. Yo, Scarn and Kydie here, representing from, come from Catford, playing for Len Johnson FC. We got Len Johnson, big guy in Manchester, done big things in the boxing world. So only right that we come out and represent him today. Part of the media team now. Do yeah, you got to do? Where, where, where do you, where do you so it's recording already, yeah. Anything. Chris Sugar sends Coyote on his first. No, Sir Chris Sugar sends Coyote on his first task. We all know where we remember him for. This is a celebrity game and there's a flipping fantastic save from Big G. We saw Dave Sheeman pull it off back in the past. When you've played over 100 games for any club, it's an achievement. But when you're playing at the. I was about to say when you're playing against Big G, it's a. That's a ricochet goal and FC Legends find themselves 1 0 up. What's going on here? It's a charity game. Who's this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Can we show him the GoPro angle? I'm just a little bit of a hater. I don't have anything going on in my life which is YouTube based, so I don't want to be on social media. Just leave me alone, you and your cameraman. Legends is a name that just keeps getting thrown about nowadays, but you are. Once you've played enough games, you know what to do in tight situations. You relax, you cool, you play out from the back. But what about when you've been referenced so long that you just feel like you don't even have to watch the game? Long are the days of Mike Dean. Oh, 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 I don't give a shit. 
Football's definitely changed over the years. The number three used to be the statement piece of a left back, but now the legends have put their number 10 at left back and it's led to a goal for legends. FC United legends 2 0 up. They're really making it their day. What a long way to travel to get nothing. It is where it is. We're here for a bigger cause. We're 2 0 down and we register our first shot on target. We're playing against a very experienced side and I know it. You're looking at it thinking, yeah, what a pass. You've got to keep your hands up at all times or if you ain't protecting yourself, you can't turn over. FC Legends are in again. The Koto, who's actually a UFC fighter, just let a lady go inside. Take that. Keep her. Toss pot. How do you break down size with so much experience? You have to move the ball. And there's always going to be opportunities that open up for the... It's a wide effort, but we've got to clap it off and stay positive. Dancing on ice. How about dancing with the stars? Beautiful ball, two-touch football. And again, we're in on the old boys. And they're just making it look that easy. And when they get the opportunity, they stick it on our back line. But you've got a keeper in there. Lamentore, you know what you signed up for. You have to introduce the aggression. You've got to say it's my ball. Give it here, give it here. Look at <laughs> Lady Ice puts one of her teammates on the floor and starts doing a bit of trickery. Yeah, you want to be here. I want to be here. How about Lady Ice introduces them to Manny? I'll introduce them to London. I'll pump it long in the back line. And is that Coyote? Coyote, long distance strike. Cheers, mate. What a polite gentleman. That ain't polite. He's looked up and he's found the nine in a pocket of space. He looks like there's no one around him. Terrific save by Big G. The 10 who've been playing left back scores in havoc. He's inside, two touch finishes. Another save by Big G. Hello everybody, you look comfortable at home? While you're there, I'm working in the German capital with Harry Kane, England and Tottenham's top goal scorer. You want to lock the big guy? You've got to be cool and composed. Are the celebs going to win this game? No chance. You're made for it or you ain't. Big game, big players. And we're the biggest. My friend, was you in that place in Egypt? What? What place? What place in Egypt? In denial. Ah, for job. We're in trouble. What's your thoughts on that first half? Onslaught. All for charity. Right, second half will go exactly as we are. The only sort of tactical thing you need to think about is if you're in midfield, you need to be in midfield. When they're breaking on us, there's such a massive gap between the defence. We're essentially playing five at the back and five up front and they're fucking nothing in the middle. Just have some shots. We're here for goals. Yeah, no one's here fucking playing for contracts. We're here to just entertain people. So entertain them, yeah? Have a little sportsman amongst yourself who can get the most legs, who can do the most take on. It's just a fucking laugh of it. 2 um, 0, mm. quite embarrassing for them in all. Yeah. 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 You know. With only two, they only got two. Yeah. 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 Uh, quick one as well, lads yeah. and girls. Uh, we was meant to do it before the game, but we forgot in all the excitement. Before the second half, we're going to take the knee. I know, obviously, taking the knee's uh, not in trend anymore, but that's the whole reason we're here. It's an anti racist event. It's about celebrating Len Johnson, who obviously wasn't allowed to box for a British title because of his skin colour. So just before kick off, we'll take the knee. They'll take the knee for a few yeah. seconds, take it they in, know. and then play. Yeah, they, they know. <laughs> Trust me, if we score one, they will feel like shit. So yeah. 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 It's coming. I'm telling it's coming. you, we'll get one. So. That one. All I want lucky, is one. You know? I swear to you, we oh, get that one and we run to the oh, f***ing oh, bench and we say, please don't come all this way and not get one goal today. Stay together and stay positive because I know it's easy to moan. It's easy. It's easy to go, ah, f***ing know that was shit. Just run a little bit harder for each other, innit? And it will, we enjoy it, man. It's a bloody nice day, and the cause is bigger than individuals, isn't it? Cool. So let's keep going, yeah? Almost there, man. A few changes at half time, and hopefully, it's going to bring a bit of inspiration. A beautiful ball over the back line, and here's another shot. I don't think we're going to win this game at this rate. But uh, you know me, what a world time run! <laughs> what are the officials watching? A bit of lackadaisical defending and all of a sudden we're getting the tricks out. Oh, 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 oh. 
Hello. Hey, this is my guy. He goes inside. Here's another pass. Please give me something to actually enjoy. Oh. Trench work can only be done in the trenches. That's why they brought me out. They've asked me to try and find a way to keep us in the game. And that's a beautiful pass into the centre forwards. You're looking for people in that pocket. And it, that's backed up by another beautiful pass. How about that for trickery? Well, oh, terrific save and a rebound goes over. That was our chance. 2-1, dangerous scoreline. Whoever scores next is really going to have an opportunity. And that's Giggsy. He lobs it. Oh, he's come off the crossbar. The crowd are on their feet. They're paying for blood. And they're going to say, who next? Oh, I'm bitterly disappointed to see the goal like that. But you can see it. The actual football ground has scored. We're going to have to give FC Manchester home ground the goal score. Congratulations on scoring your first goal. A stadium has scored. That's how bad it's got. But we don't care, we're here to play football and give it a go. The goalkeeper misplaces it. And, oh, come on! I said I wanted one! Just the one! It's scrappy! And they all count! Pull in the back of the net! The selected bag! Come on! <laughs> The deficit's been cut by one. We're still in it. But these old boys, their IQ is ridiculous. That's a beautiful ball inside. But it's matched by that clutch player, Big G. He's 1v1 and he still manages to put it over the crossbar. That's a delightful pass. The belief has grown in the side. We've only just met each other today. Put your head where it hurts. Intuitive play by Big G has led to a quick counter-attacking break. And all of a sudden, the All-Stars are in. The legends are showing that they can't get back. That's unbelievable trickery in the 18 yard box. Take that. I'm telling you, they don't want it. Believe, believe, believe. Put your red words, love it. I'll do it. Love it, 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 Tori. Who's this? You've watched this game. There's been no shortcuts. This ain't Deliveroo. This is home cooked meals. Coyote trying to anti hard to play football and he gets absolutely smashed. <laughs> What's going on here? Referee. He's 67 minutes in. He's blown for a water break. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. Whether to look at this is it's a half, a, a cup half full or half empty. Oh, boys. You said it, didn't you? you? Said it, bro. There's a water. You are killing it. I genuinely, I didn't think we were going to have any fucking hope of winning this whatsoever. But you fucking in it, and the next goal has got our name all over it. Be resolute in defence, stick with it, stay nice and compact, do not dive in, just delay. That's all you need to do, <laughs> delay and buy yourself time. When we get the ball, let's look forward, put it forward, and as soon as we get into this final third, have a fucking shot. The winner is going to be ours. Yep. We are going to get the equaliser next, and we're going to go on and win yep. this. Let's fucking go. Come on, mate. Come on. Tactics have gone out the window. But the basics are, if you can't play through the middle, you play down the sides. If you can't play down the sides, you play down the middle. Route one tactics, and this led to another attack. And it's in the bottom of the post. It's not my fault. The Len Johnson Cup could only be played in one way, and that's by having a real tear up about back and forth action. And it's actually led from us being 3-0 down to 3... Hello? Hello? A chance has presented itself. How have we done this? This ain't a glitch on FIFA. This is real stuff. A half-hearted challenge has led to an attack, and we have got ourselves a game on.
What a fight. What, hey, it's had it all. Uppercuts, right hooks, left hooks, south paws, orthodoxies. It's had misses, it's had goals. A stadium has scored. And as we approach the, obviously the 90th minute and we're about to blow up for full time, I'd like you to remember to like, comment and subscribe. And in the comments below, I'd like you to say stand up together. The referee's blown for full time, but this ain't a fight that's done. We, are, we need a winner. Give us penalties. Here we go. Game changer. Game changer. <laughs> Had to hit the sea, bro. Yeah, yeah, I saw that. I see that still. <laughs> Who wants to go first? Right, one minute. One minute. Because not everyone's going to be able to take one, obviously. 20 of us. There's two things you can do with penalties. You lot can decide, or I can tell you and take the pressure off. I can tell you whether I go left or right. What do you want to do? You want to choose yourself? You decide. 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 Do you want to decide? Yeah, yeah. Okay, my only instruction is to you then, choose a side, it's it hard and low, stay, on whichever decision, if you're going left, go left, you go right, you go right, that's it. That's all you've got to do. Len Johnson FC say they want to throw the first punch. There it is, bottom left, take that. United legends, step up, first penalty taker, Big G. Goes the right way, but doesn't keep it out. Lady Ice, not cool enough. United Legends, he's gone the right way and he hasn't kept it out. Lamentore, Cherry Founder, no doubt. Oh no, it's wide. He's sunbathing, Jeff. He's sunbathing. This is your moment. Oh, it's a phenomenal save by the United Legend Keeper. Can you do it? Can you stay calm? Done it so many times over the years, Jeff. 45 goals for the club in his time. Oh, it's over. Led Johnson FC have been knocked out with the final blow. United Legends go home as penalty winners. Thank you so much for subscribing. Thank you so much for watching. But again, I want you to remember what the message is today. What is it, Big G? We stand up against racism and we will not tolerate it. Thank you so much for your support. Big up everyone involved in the charity. Thank you for everyone for the pictures and messages. God bless you. We're out. Ah, oh, mate, what a way to lose, but fair play, man. And also a good call, Big Absolute legend, man. Thank you, man. Pleasure. Yeah, of course you can, Baba. We've come all this way, we've given an honest shift and, it, and it's the calls, in it? It's all the calls. Okay, so we're the winners at heart. Yeah, I mean, Len Johnson team, Lady Ice, we won. Out. No, no. Cheers, bro, man. Getting a, getting a crowd here, interactive as well. Oh, yeah, we're running out for the back. Fuming, fuming. <laughs> Some banking saves. Fuming, fuming. Some top saves there. Top, top. London to Manchester, my side, you get me representing, man. You guys are amazing. Shout out to all the guns. Even before I go to my under 21s matches, I'll be just watching you guys be like, alright, cool. When I get in this game, I've got to have that, that, that mm. confidence, you know what I mean? Because I watch football players, but when you see a team that come from the ground, it's, it's more soil. Probably. You guys inspire me. Make sure you tell them who you are. Yeah, my name is Roberto. I'm an artist. We're going to be performing up there in the lounge, actually. Uh, my Instagram, official one Roberto. Watch out for me, man. What did you think of the performance today? My performance? Uh, good. I appreciate that. Where are you from? Are you from around here? Yeah. All right. Oh, look, look, look. Your friends, got, your friends here as well. Sorry. What did you think of the goalkeeper's performance, Big G? What did you think of it? Really good. Really good. You're brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> top, top performance. And then, 
Anything for the Dons, the family's growing. Big up you, I'm Manchester Don. We're all here today to raise funds for the statue of Len Johnson, uh, Manchester's own crown boxing champion, a West African guy, born in 1902 to a Sierra Leone father and an Irish yeah. Mancunian mother. Unbelievable record, he had 135 fights, 93 wins, wasn't allowed to box for the British title simply because of his skin colour. So all these years later we're recognising him, we're remembering him and we're honouring him with a, uh, with, a, with a statue and this game helps us raise some of the funds towards that and we will make it an annual event. Um, so I'm very grateful for, the, for everyone for coming out, coming down uh, and Big G for, for clattering me. I've probably got a little bit of concussion, my back's gone, but it's all good. Len Johnson was known to be one of the best boxers in the country in the 1920s, but the authorities stopped him from competing for titles because he was black. Anthony Crawler and Andy Burnham were among those who made an appearance at today's match against FC United. Len Johnson is a man who some people don't know about and they should do. He was wrongly, wasn't allowed to fight for a British title because of the colour of his skin and I'd like to think times have now changed but that was another Manchester legend who was denied the opportunity and he inspired so many and it's just for him never to be forgotten about and he shouldn't be. I think Moss Side has produced great fighters over the years and he's certainly been an inspiration to that and I just think it'd be right to have a statue of the great man. Yeah, it's very exciting. I think, you know, Len Johnson should be a household name. If you went down the street and asked anyone if they knew who Muhammad Ali was, everyone would answer yes and it should be the same for Len Johnson. So it's about raising awareness, building the profile of his unbelievable story and it's a tragic story. The fact he couldn't fight for the title because of his skin colour is a crying shame um, and we want to we want to honour him with a statue and want to remember his legacy and that's what this is all about. The non-league season has started. We weren't able to record the pre-season games like we did previously. So this year we're going straight into the season, which is the fixtures. Hey! Referee! This league is so unpredictable. Anybody that's been in it over the last few years, it doesn't matter how you start, it's about how you finish. We work hard, we stay close together, and we fucking work through the hard times and we come out better, yeah? First tackle before I go, first fucking tackle, yeah, lads. It's ours. Second, first second ball is ours. Get it up! 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 Get it up!